Hi you guys, I hope everybody's doing well and uh, getting prepared for Christmas. Uh, I know I am, you know, I'm trying to stay positive. Uh, in a society like this, it's not easy, but we all have to try. Anyway, with that said, what you're looking at here uh, is a crop photo of something that I acquired from um, Steve Olson's channel many years ago, uh, probably around 2017, I want to say, uh, is when I got this. Uh, now, what's important is what I'm going to show you after this, okay? Uh, this confirms that this photo that was leaked out is authentic. Um, and I've proved it to myself. Okay. Um, now let me go over some things here. Um, you see this ridge here, this and, and right here, like a V. Okay. I'm glad that I added the contrast so you could you guys could see a little bit better what's going on here in the craters and this object here that, that uh, is that very close this one and this one I believe all of this is like cloud cover okay <clears throat> and uh, because it looks like it's detached from this you can see if you go if you look right in this area here you can see a nice circle uh, and these arrows, this was, it was called, I'll show you this at the end, okay? Uh, after I show you the, the, the latest pictures that I've, t that I've taken from a couple of days ago. Um, so, uh, this is pointing to all of their ancient Sumerian names, all right? That's what this was. And this one was pointing at this one back here, it said Nibiru, okay? So I have no doubt that that's accurate because take a look at this. This is a photo that I took back in January of 2016, okay? Uh, I'm sure you already know. I'm sure you could see it already. The similarities is shocking. The ridge, look, you can see this ridge here. You can see it very... And, I, and this, keep in mind, I had to shoot this through. It was that this day was very heavily chem trailed. Okay, so there's no doubt about it. This is the same object. I, 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 there's no question about this. None at all. No question about it. Look, you could see this. You could see there's one here hidden behind the this chem trail. The, between the chem trails and this the sun simulator. I mean, they make it almost impossible to see anything, you know, uh, but you can see big old crater here, the craters, but the main thing is this and these things, see, if you go back, they match, look, one was taken probably from the Hubble, and this, this was taken by me, so I mean, there's going to be some differences, but you can see it's the same object. Anybody that has any common sense can, can see that. That's not really a, a problem. Okay. Uh, so, let me show you these few things. And then at the end, you'll see the whole system. Okay. Uh, so, anyway, this was taken um, a few days ago. And uh, you could, as you can see... Look at all of the, look at the patterns, I mean here, the same thing right here, I mean following closely. I believe that this could be Nibiru, okay, but it keeps between the reflections and everything else around it. I mean, I don't know enough to say one way or the other what it, what it has with it, but this is the, the whole system is here showing itself now. I mean, that's pretty, ob pretty obvious. Look, you can see the same thing here, look. And if you didn't notice already, you guys, look, what color is that? Green, same thing as that picture. For, now this is really interesting here. Get a load of this. Look at that. 
the red and everything, the two craters up here, you can't really see it that well. I could probably see it better on my screen. Um, I'm doing the best I can with the camera that what I have. Okay, there you go. There you go. That's, that's better. I had to tilt the camera. But see, now you can see what's up there. And keep this picture in mind because I'm going to show you something else that I took in 2015. It matches it perfectly. Okay, let me go back. There's another shot of it. I just It's just light, a little bit lighter. Um, this one doesn't show up very well, but I did my best. But anyway, it, it, this, it's a clear gap right here. Same situation. And keep in mind, folks, <clears throat> this is all the same object. Now, this one, this is the one from 2015. I shot this uh, in the New Orleans area, 2015. See, any, see, look at that. Same thing. Same thing. Same thing. That that big gap right here, and that that black enlarged area, right? You can see, and it's an orangey red, orange red, and. You may not be able to see it very well. Obviously, it didn't show up too well. Uh, but this is a long debris field. Tell you what, let me try and uh, tilt the camera again, and then we're going to see what we can get here. Yeah, see? And then you, you, if you, look, you could see the debris, debris field all through here. Not only that, but when I zoomed in, now you can see the true color of the snapshot. And of course, this up here, I don't know what that is. But also, you guys, before I continue, I want to mention something about uh, Pray for uh, Matt Rogers in the UK, Sky Observer. I haven't seen him around. And not only that, his channel is gone. All of a sudden, it's just gone. I don't know what happened. But I think we all can guess. See, look, same thing. I just took a different shot. Okay, back to the recent. Uh, here's another shot of it. And um, keep in mind, like I said, this is all the same object. I didn't... It keeps changing. Um, see? But this ridge keeps showing up little by little. I mean, it just, in almost every shot. <sighs> okay. Here's something very interesting. I took this, I think, in 2018, right outside my apartment. Look at this thing. Look. This is what was coming up in the sky, folks. I mean, look at this. This is, this is the object. That's what I'm showing you. I mean, this is it. Look. The craters. The V shapes that that we all see, look. I mean, this is this was. In, I was shocked when I saw this. I said, "You mean to tell me this thing can get this close?" Well, obviously it can, because that was a clear sky. I was fortunate enough to get it. I just I I don't know what camera I had back then. Um, I think I had a Nokia Lumia, the best one that was available at the time. Um, 2016, 2017. I know I'm going back and forth, and I, I didn't want to do that, but I just wanted to show people the correlations uh, between what I got back then and what I have now. All right, again, this is the same object. See how it keeps changing colors? Again, there's that, there's that familiar ridge. Well, I don't know. Um, I think back... Um, you know, when it was going through the solar system, it just kept getting bombarded, perhaps in the same areas, and it formed that canal, obviously, because it keeps showing up. Oh, look, here's another one from Turkey UFO report I had a long time ago. See? Same? It look familiar? Look. Same thing. Now, yeah, here's that, come to the end of the video, and this is the... P.S. de Resistance.
Okay. There it is. It says Nibiru here. And as you can see, like I showed you in the front, in the beginning, um, I confirmed that, that this is real, so the rest of it's got to be. This is called, this starts with an N. This kind of got cropped off here, I don't know, but this is a part of the system as well. But these are all the, the ancient Sumerian names of, of everything. This is Nemesis. This is what we call Nemesis today. Um, and uh, some people have named them modern names, like after uh, Carlos Ferrada and uh, Harrington, um, which is fine, you know. But this is their ancient Sumerian names, uh, and uh, that's it. And uh, I'm still putting together that uh, small playlist for you guys. Uh, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do one more uh, covering this subject, and then I'm going to go back to uh, the quantum effects, uh, probably starting with the Bible changes again. Um, we're really at uh, a precipice. Uh, I, I mean, I don't know what to say, folks. The world just continues to deteriorate around us. You know, and I could see why they want to keep this a secret because if this is the physical proof of uh, the end times, and they are very, very desperate to keep this a secret, and they are um, between between the the hump team uh, chemical uh, trails that they're uh, putting in the sky, the sun simulator. And the fact that uh, there's a large group of the population that has absolutely no clue whatsoever at all what's going on up there, nor do they care. Um, like I said in the previous video, this is the most apathetic society that I've ever seen in my life. And um, I really shouldn't be surprised, you know. Anyway... Um, you guys stay safe um, and sane, and I'll be back again um, with uh, another report.